Arizona and Sonora Desert. There lives one of the only venomous lizards in North America, closely related to the Heloderma lizard. We are talking about the Gila monster. The word Gila refers to the river that stretches 630 miles, 1,014 kilometers through New Mexico and Arizona flowing west into the Colorado River. The Gila monster lives in, a, in the blazing heat and is near threatened. The protection of these lizards' environment is vital. The capital of Arizona, which is a booming city of Phoenix, which is home to 1.5 million people and growing, was built on the Gila monsters and several other species' habitats. The Gila monster is an interesting animal with a lifespan of 20 to 30 years. It can grow up to 2 feet long and weigh 5 pounds. It is a very calm animal, for 95% of its lifetime consists of sleeping, usually in underground burrows. It can survive without food for over a year. During dry season, it drinks an immense amount of water, so when it's asleep, it won't die of dehydration. The heel monster's diet consists of nests and small animals. The Gila monster is a shy lizard, and if it were to see a human, it would most likely run away. But when people don't keep their distance, the Gila monster will attack you if you provoke it. If you are in the unlikely situation, it will chomp onto you and not let go, being one of the only venomous lizards in North America, it will release venomous saliva onto its victims. So in conclusion, leave them alone, or you'll get chomped. These harmless lizards are usually hidden away in their burrows, but poachers have noticed the time when lizards are more active. During the monsoon season, Gila monsters tend to go outside of their burrows to cool off their bodies. Poachers will explore the Arizona highways on the lookout for the Gila monsters. Once they find one and realize it's fairly easy to take, the Gila monster can't defend themselves so they simply pick it up and capture it. Why do poachers that rush these harmless animals from their habitats? Well, in the folklore and myth around the Gila monster, some people believe they have magical powers. For instance, they believe it can control the weather, and their hide has healing power. Poachers, knowing in the, that the people believe in this, will sell Gila monsters on the black market where they can make up to 1,500 American dollars per animal making the Gila monster a profitable target for the poachers. The Gila monsters have a very low population. An estimated 2,000 Gila monsters are believed to be remaining. The population is decreasing mainly by human deforestation. For example, Phoenix, Arizona may have been a huge area where Gila monsters most probably have lived. But since the construction of the city, the Gila monsters have been forced out of their habitats and or killed. If destruction of habitats continues, the Gila monster could potentially reach extinction. If we can spread this problem out to the public, we can make something happen before the Gila monsters go extinct. We need to make sure the construction the companies are aware of where they're making something and make it somewhere that isn't destroying a potential habitat. If we can meet this goal, we can stop the Gila monster's population from decreasing even more. Thank you. Ooh.